Welcome to AmeenAcademy.com in Mathematical Economics. Let us discuss about uses of basic algebra in economics. First, we will talk about exponents. Exponent is defined as the method of expressing large numbers in terms of powers. That means the exponent refers to how many times a number multiplied by itself. Suppose, here, yeah, take an example, 16. 16 can be expressed as 2 power 4, which means 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. Now, 27 can be expressed 3 into 3 into 3, which is equal 3 power 3 like. 0 exponents, some loss will do. Anything power 0 is always 1. Any number, for example, 440 is 1, 100 power 0 also 1, anything x power 0 is 1. That means anything power 0 is always 1. Next, identity exponents law. That is a power 1 is a, anything power 1. That is 5 power 1 is 5, 8 power 1 is 8, like. The power index is 1 means that the base number will come. Product law. A power m into a power n is a power m plus n, which means a is some basic a common number, suppose 5 into 2 into 5 into 3, we can express this as 5 is a common base, add the power 2 plus 3 is 5 power 5. 5, 5 power 5, we can calculate that is 625 into, because 5 power 4 is 625 into 4. 22 carries 2 for 8, 9. 5 is 5 is 25, 2 carries, 5 2 is 10, 10 plus 2 is 12, 1 carries, 5 6 are 30, plus 1 is 31. 3, 1, 6, 5. Like here, next to us, quotient rule. a power m over a power n is a power m minus n. Same like here, if division comes, that here subtraction. Next is negative power. a power minus m is 1 over a power m. Power sub power. a power m power n is a power m n. Power of product. a, b, that is the basis different power is same so we have separated a power m into b power m power of quotient a power b whole power m is a power m over b power m let us do something further one more here x power a b which means x power b over a. Now let us do some examples regarding this concept here. We'll do examples here. Suppose x2 into x3. What it is? It becomes x power 3 plus 2 is 5. x y power 5, which is x power 5, y power 5. Square root of x, third root of x square, which is equal x 2 over 3. Like we can do the power uh, means loss of exponents. We can understand now. Next one, polynomials. In all, in algebra, polynomial is more useful for economics. Also, a polynomial is defined as an expression which is composed of variables, constants, and exponents. 
that are combined using mathematical operations such as addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Look at this for example. 8x power 5 plus 3x power 2 plus 4x plus 3. This is a polynomial of degree 5. The highest power is 5 here. Now, how to add two polynomials? Look at here. 3x squared plus 4x plus 3 into 2x squared minus 8x plus 3. Here, the collecting the like terms here. 3x squared plus 2x squared. Addition is 5x squared. Then 4x is the like term is minus 8x. 4x minus 8x is minus 4x. 3 plus 3 is 6. This is the addition of Next one, we will do subtraction. 7x cube minus 4x plus 3. Subtraction. 2x squared minus 5. Here, the like terms are subtracted here. 7x cube, here no like term, so we have to write as it is. 7x cube. Here, Next is here 2x squared. Here there is no x squared term. So only we have to write as it is minus into 2 is minus 2x squared. Here 4x minus 4x. Here there is no x term. So minus 4x. Here minus 4x. Then 3. The like term is minus 5. But outside is minus. So it's plus 5. 3 plus 5 is 3 plus 5 is 8. So it is a subtraction. Now some divisions will do. Here 18 x cube y square over 3 x y which is equal 18 over 3 is 6 x cube over x is x square y squared over y is y. Now we will do some multiplication here. 8x 12 y squared. What it is here? 8 and 12 is 96. x there is no x here, so x as it is right, y squared. Now, multiplying two binomials, for example, 7x plus 3y into 4x plus y. How to multiply this? Here, first term 7x, multiply with that two terms in the second, then middle is plus 3y that is 3y into 4x plus y. 7 into 4 is 28, x into x is x square, then 7x plus into y is 7xy. Here, 3y into 4x is 12yx or xy plus then 3 into y into y is 3y square. So we'll write in simplified manner 28x square. Here the like term is 7xy, 12xy. So both are added is 19xy plus 3y square. Now, one more binomial with a trinomial. Look at here 4x minus y into 3x plus 5y plus 2z. 
here 2 that is binomial is multiplied with the trinomials distribute this 4x into 3x plus 5y plus 2z minus y into same as it is 3x 5y plus 2z which is equal 3 fours are 12 x square then 3 5 4 uh, 4 fives are 20 x into xy then 4x into 2z is 8 xz minus here minus y into 3x is minus 3xy minus 3 minus 1 into 5 is minus 5 y into is y square minus y into 2 z is minus 2 y z now like terms are collected here there is no like terms for a 12 x square as it is right here 20 x y here minus 3 x y 20 minus 3 is 17 x y 8 x z there is no 8 x z that right as it is 8 x z here minus uh, next is minus 2 y z then minus 5 y square but here no time here 12 x square there is no such y square term 12 x square then next is 20 x y minus 3 x y that is 17 minus 3 is 20 minus 3 is 17 x y 8 x z there is no like terms x z term so 8 x z minus 3 2 y z minus 2 y z and minus 5 y square like these are the basic algebra which will be useful in economics so far we discussed about basic algebra uses in economics in further videos we will discuss further about basic algebras in economics we have done please subscribe our youtube channel